know, Americans are believing in looking out for America. It doesn't matter if a guy is black or white or green. If a guy is being discriminated against, then it should be taken care of. Farmers uh, feed America, and that's what we do. And I enjoyed doing what I did. I'm a chicken grower and I've been for 28 years. I know the chicken is good that you're gonna be buying and purchasing, but in a sense, it's not worth it. It's a cutthroat industry, it's a cutthroat company. Every, everything that they do is uh, uncivilized and they just didn't like black folks and I knew that and I knew to stay pretty much in my place. Nobody black in the office, uh, no black servicemen, no black nowhere. And uh, it's hard to deal with someone when they are prejudiced. I give them a chance to try to change and do better, and they never did. And, uh, you know, I just said, I'm going to start standing up to you. I mean, that's how it is. I miss my place so dearly, and it's so breathtaking and heart wrenching to even go by there to even think about it. My health has failed and all those things due to the losing of my farm and uh, it caused me to lose my wife and family. So it's just uh, been a very tough situation and a tough ordeal that I have gone through. You know, they just made an example out of me. They knew if they did me dirty and, and uh, I got cut off and lost everything I had, it would get out. And the rest of the guy would say, hey, Mr. Sanders had lost everything he had. Uh, we don't want to do that. It's, it's one of those things that you'll regret signing the contract. Once you stick your uh, your name on that dotted line, you know, they know that you either gonna win or you're gonna lose.